Hi. <clears throat> this is Megan and uh, Monty coming at you. Um, I haven't made any videos for a while. Uh, I want to apologize because my last few videos, actually like all of my videos have sucked. I mean, they're horrible. And I really need to learn how to, like, okay, I got constructive criticism um, on my videos, which was, it was true. Like, for example, I got this new computer and I, my last video was a ghost stories that was like really slow and boring. And I apologize for that, but I don't know how to look at the camera because I don't know where the camera is. Right now, I'm trying to look in the camera, but when I look in the camera, I can't see myself, so it's kind of, like, confusing. Oh, I just want to let you know Monty's too. So. Oh, excuse I'm sorry that I'm... Ah! Oh. I have real bad dry mouth. Um, medication is... So, I apologize. Okay, so, uh, my, all right, um, gosh, my head, I have a million thoughts going through my head right now, and it's so hard to just express any kind of words because I've got a thousand things going around in circles, and I can't really, like, focus, but I'm going to try right now. I'm going to really try to focus on what I'm trying to talk about in this video. What I'm trying to talk about is, uh, I'm trying, I need to improve my channel. I wanted to, I started off with, um, like just putting music on there. And then I started watching videos of, um, like people talking about their openly about their mental illnesses and, I especially related to uh, this one uh, YouTuber, Des I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, uh, Des Desaroma, and I started watching her, and her videos were like, it was like when she was talking, I everything she said, I kept thinking, oh my god, me too, me too, me too. I totally related to not everything that she said, but uh, probably... I'd say 80% of the stuff that she talked about or talked about going through, I went through the same things. And so, and I really liked how she was um, advocating for mental illness. She made it seem like, okay, like, um, even if you have a mental illness, you're still a productive member of society or, like, you're not just a total loser, you're cool, and you do stuff, and you're not the stere you know, the stereotype and stigma that they have for mental illness, it was like she was helping to eradicate that, and that's what I wanted to do too, um, but I haven't been doing a very good job, and I don't know how to edit videos, uh, I just really don't really know what I'm doing and I'm going to work on it. Um, so anyway, oh, by the way, so the point was, okay, I looked up to her and I started making my own videos and watching her videos. And just the other day I met her on Facebook and we, uh, we were in the, the same group um, support group for, uh, our illness, one of our illness, and, um, I, I saw her there, and I friend requested her, and sent her a message, and she accepted, and we talked for a little while, and it just, like, kind of really actually brought me out of my depression, and I just, it inspired me to make this new, this video today that, um, 
was about, like, I, I would like some comments, um, not, I, I, I just, I've received some nasty comments and had to delete them, so please nothing, like, mean and nasty calling me fat, because I, I know I am, and, uh, I'm working on it, it's, it's a battle, it's an everyday battle, um, but anyway, you don't have to call me fat. You don't have to leave a message saying that. And, uh, but if you could leave a message on how I, like, what, what would you like me to talk about in my videos? And, because I want to mix it up a little bit. And, uh, also, how can I improve them? Um, I like backgrounds, obviously. And I know I got to learn to stay still and look at the camera and, plan out what I'm going to talk about maybe and stick to the story instead of going off on tangents all the time. I have a big problem with that. Okay. Um, oh, and there was just something else I wanted to show you guys. Uh, I want to show you guys my medications that I take. I just filled up my med cassette today and I'm so proud of myself. Hey, look at this. Um, it's got every day, and I'll show you. Okay, for example, just take out one day. This is Sunday morning, noon, night, and I'll open them. Uh, I don't know, can you see all the pills? I can't tell if you can see them or not, but that's how many pills I take a day. Um, and that's not counting the, there's no PRNs in there, so there's actually more. I think I counted it, it's like seven, whoa, they're popped out in Neurontin. Um. I think it's like 17 pills in here a day, at, at least, something like that. But then uh, also, um, I also often have to take this. Uh, it sucks, but it helps. It's the only thing that helps my pain and my asthma. I'm starting to have a flare-up. Um, then I also take this, it's a inhaler in cruise, uh, I take this, Adverus inhaler, I take this, it's um, Spiriva inhaler, and then I'm physically dependent, it sucks, but it's the only way that I can breathe, I get a special order from a special pharmacy, these uh, nebulizer treatments that are different than the regular kind of nebulizers that people get. This has like an added uh, ipotropium, also known as like a, uh, there's another name for ipotropium, but I don't know, but it's mixed with the albuterol. So it's in like uh, files and I'd have to take it four times a day in my nebulizer. So there, yeah, I just wanted to show you all my meds, but mostly I was just very proud of this putting together this med kit set because I've been pretty bad lately about it's hard. Just I just take them out of the bottle and sometimes I can't remember if I took it or not. So I don't know if I should take it a second time or if I should not take it, but Mostly the, the biggest one is the Nexium. Like, if I think that I forgot to take the Nexium, then I don't care. I'll take that again because Nexium, um, without it, I have bad heartburn. Okay. Uh, this was a very, very stupid video. Uh, I don't even know if I should download it. I think I should start over. Shoot, it's 10 minutes. Okay, 10 minutes. Ever, goodbye. Bye.
Monty says, bye-bye, bye-bye. He's really special. Um, he's had a rough life, and uh, I rescued him. And he's a good boy. He sleeps with me. Okay. Um, talk to you later, and if you're watching uh, Desaroma, hi. <laughs> Bye.